third phase of moon here, Blake Cousins, going over the phenomenon known as harp we have a round table going on right now new photos just in along with the best videos that have been coming into third phase of moon for the past year of unusual cloud formations portals amazing eyewitness testimony we're going to get to the bottom of what harp is all about or maybe new questions we're going to bring in analyst Orlando Smith right now he's never seen these photos or videos before we want to get his opinion right away of what he thinks this is it just looks like classic geoengineering to me obviously uh, man-made structures in those cloud formations probably the dispersion of chemicals uh, rendering a temperature uh, changing uh, harp induced situation right there is what my guess would be I don't know you know or maybe it's just some really incredible spiral clouds you know asking the big question a regular spiral cloud I've seen a lot of these right here in the state of Hawaii Brent has as well he's joining us on the round table it's an incredible sunset spectacular phenomenon shared right here at third phase of moon your opinion like i gotta admit this is basically 100 percent the best heart video that's coming in to our documentary that you're going to see right here we got four awesome videos and we got a professor a friend of ours he knows what he's talking about about geospace harp and all this great stuff and what we're looking at here it's just fantastic it's beautiful and i do think that it's extraterrestrial what do you think blake when this video first came in, we put it out and it pretty much went viral, this video. Obviously, why not? It's some of the best unusual cloud formations that I've ever seen. It's, do you see any jets or an airliner leaving a chemtrail like this behind? Is this a chemtrail? We're going to be uh, slowing things down, getting a closer look on this video that's what it's all about right here at third phase of moon the geospatial analysts of more thoughts on this video this is this is either the best photoshop i've ever seen in my life or it's a super chemtrail man-made dispersion of some kind of chemical but it's so huge it's huge it's so much bigger than the chemtrails that i've seen and the shape, the, the circular shape is just, it's so magnificent. You know, I can't imagine that it formed from some cloud formation or some, uh, you know, the structure of the winds in the sky. It just doesn't look like it formed from that. It looks like some type of, there's different materials up there. Now we're on to this uh, next video that was posted just last, last month right here at Third phase of moon and people were saying this is another like photoshop or special effect in my opinion this is the real deal the links are below by the way to the original videos from the people that shot them that's the main thing right here at third phase of moon we're sharing the links to the source in my opinion this is some kind of portal opened up the sky is opened up and there's just some kind of plasma jet stream that's being a plasma residue. Not exactly sure exactly what's going on, but the people on the ground were stunned by this amazing footage we're looking at right here at Third Phase of Moon. Brent, take a look at this close up. What's this all about? All I gotta say is uh, hats off to the photographer. He really kept uh, his hands still and he's capturing, and then he's actually capturing a. Uh, decent enough time to actually see this formation trans transform in front of ourselves and in front of uh, the public right here. This scares me, man. I don't know. It's either extreme CGI or it's a terrifying harp induced heating of the atmosphere. I mean, it looks like flames. Let me tell you though, I have to say that 
there's all kinds of anomalies going on with this uh, video right here. And to say it's CGI is just r ridiculous. I have to say, give me an honest opinion. I'm sitting right next to you watching this video. I'm telling you, this is not CGI. This is an actual phenomenon. Look at the cloud formations around it. There, could this be maybe just a real weather phenomenon that has nothing to do with extraterrestrial? I just wondered, how did it have that square edge? I don't understand that square edge. Fair enough question. Now we're going off to this other phenomenon that came into third phase of moon and it was attributed to a rocket. Still, when the governments tell you that, hey, this is a rocket malfunctioned or some kind of trail behind it throughout the, throughout the United States or over any part of the world for that fact you might not want to believe them what is this residue that's the big question with this video Brent what's your issue on this one this happened at uh, Edwards Air Force Base and everybody knows that those guys over there they're not gonna give us the truth they're doing their own exercises their own plans if they said it's a military rocket, well, I think what we're seeing right here would be something that they would say as well. Whatever these colors are releasing the atmosphere, it's unusual, it's strange, it's green. Wow, green people. Your thoughts? It almost looks like a, a layer of excited electrons, like, like the way the way particles can become energized when they're in the, under some uh, the effects of something like heat or magnetism or something like that. They looked it looked like an energized uh, trail, a trail of energized particles. That's all I could think of. People out there. I know you've been doing your homework right here at Third Phase Moon. If you have any idea what's going on in this photograph, leave your comments below. We'd sure like to hear it. Brent, it's been 10, 20 years, maybe even longer since chemtrails, chemicals in the sky, strange formations, Blake. What we're looking at is green, brown trails, something not normal. Who would want to wake up to this? I have coffee every morning and I see something like this. It's upsetting. And I'm sure it's upsetting to the world, America especially. They're getting stripped. The question still lingers. What is going on over the skies, over planet Earth, in regards to the chemtrails? The colors, as Brent said, seems very suspicious. Everybody, have your cameras rolling. I think things are going down. It's about time people wake up. Submit your footage to Third Phase of Moon. Let us know. We're standing by. Blake Cousins. We'll see you again next time. In the sky. Blake Cousins here. Strange oh, phenomenon oh, in the sky oh, over yeah. Stockton, California. 2015 Safon submitted incredible footage of what eyewitnesses from the general area report a large UFO event that lasted for over five minutes. The blue thing right there. People were stunned as the craft shot up in the sky and left a plasma awake in the clouds. No, check out the thing in the sky. Look, it's weird. It's some kind of. That is beautiful. Check that out, you guys. But I just didn't look red. Now it's turning red. Yeah. I think it's some kind of like a plasma thing. I don't I fucking know. Oh shit, and look at the clouds. It's uh. No, over here, the, the other one we saw. Oh, what the fuck? It was weird. Look. look. Like That's a sign of something. Oh shit, and look to the right a little bit. There's a blue one developing. See it? That's a sign of something. Oh, that is, that is crazy. 
Oh, shut up. 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 Oh,